So, either you've decided to set up your UI yourself, or you've imported another player's UI via their username in the Edit Layout settings, and want to change parts of it to suit you better. There are several key things I'll quickly run over that should help you customise it. The UI in RuneScape 3 is fully customisable, almost everything can be changed. First of all, if the bars in your UI are blue in colour, then it is locked. By default, it is L on your keyboard to unlock or lock it. And when unlocked, any window can be moved or resized, and any tabs in these windows can be separated or regrouped. This not only means that you can make windows as large or as small as you want, you can also do things such as widen your minimap to see far into the distance to scout for boss enemies in a specific dungeon, or stretch the chat box to get nice screenshots of back-to-back -back loot drops. If your UI feels too small, or the icons or text too hard to see, you can scale it all up with the interface scaling option in the graphic settings. There are several other useful options here, such as removing roofs, increasing draw distance, and toggling loading screens, but these are all up to personal choice and slightly off topic. If you feel instead that your UI is taking up too much space on your screen, there are three things you can change that might help. In the appearance section, the headers on top of each window can be hidden, or the bar at the top entirely removed whilst the UI is locked. You are also able to set the transparency of your UI in case you want a little more visibility behind it. If you also feel like there's not enough space around your character, you can re-enter the edit layout mode and use the advanced options for even more customization options. Say, for example, you don't like that your character is centered on the screen, but not centered when compared to your UI. You can resize even the game view itself. The advanced options contain many extra UI elements in the game that only appear at certain times, and these vary greatly in the frequency at which they appear and the utility in moving them. All of these can be moved around and resized the same as regular interfaces in the menu, but there are a lot of them to mull over, so I personally recommend rearranging these as you encounter them, rather than trying to set it all up right now. 